for the top story tonight, keeping on the, an eye, I should say, on those who would be president. Last night, the Democratic candidates got a bit rowdy. Senator Obama, it is very difficult having a uh, straight up debate with you because you never take responsibility for any vote. And that has been a pattern. You in this in the Illinois, now wait a minute, in the Illinois State Legislature, just a minute, in the Illinois State Senate, Senator Obama voted 130 times present. That's not yes, that's not no, that's maybe. You talked about Ronald Reagan being a transformative political leader. I did not mention his name. Your husband you, did. Well, I'm here. He's okay, not. Okay, well, and I can't tell who I'm running against that time. Let's talk about Ronald Reagan. What you just repeated here today is patent. Wait, no, Obama, Hillary, Obama, you just I did not, spoke. I did you not say anything about minutes. Ronald Reagan. You said two you do, things. You, you talked spoke. about admiring Hillary, Ronald Reagan, sorry, and you talked about you, the you ideas spoke, of the Senator, Republicans. Senator, what I said was, is that Ronald Reagan was a transformative political figure because he was able to get Democrats to vote against their economic interests to form a majority to push through their agenda, an agenda that I objected to because while I was working on those streets, watching those folks see their jobs shipped overseas, you were a corporate lawyer sitting on the board of Walmart. I was fighting these fights. I was fighting these fights. I was fighting against those ideas when you were practicing law and representing your contributor, Resco, in his slum landlord business in inner city Chicago. Are there three people in this debate, not two? I don't think there was really two that matter. And joining us now from New Hampshire, Fox News analyst Juan Williams and from Washington, Democrat.